You're right there guys and welcome back to another way to turn on the channel. I'm James. I'm Adam. And uh, yeah, we're here today in Fulham for the second time we've been here. First time was our second ever away days we've done on the channel. Yeah. Adam, should we just tell them how it went that first time? Well yeah, as you see probably if you have seen the video before, yeah we did lose 2-1. How was Wait. the recording though? I'm pretty sure we recorded like that, yeah, like that which but... uh, definitely isn't the way to go. But um, yeah, obviously we're here in Fulham today. It's a pretty interesting one. I uh, wasn't able to get your preview, your predictions, all things like that. Obviously I did say your prediction, but uh, I don't know if you want to tell everyone else. Um, what do you reckon is going to happen with a team obviously with Liam Moore suspended? Uh, do you want to just tell them that now? Uh, yeah, I think um, Gunnar, uh, Paul McShane and... Blackett. Blackett, yeah, <laughs> sorry, Scott. Um, it's going to be the starting line up at the back three, I reckon. So it's going to be right wing back, maybe a left wing back, and that's what I think. And then score prediction as well. So you went for 2 2. We're going to originally go for a 1 1. What do you reckon, mate? Uh, I'm going to go for 2 2. Um, he has on the score first. I think it's just going to happen, isn't it? That's what I said as well. It always happens that every time yeah. a Reading player has to score in front of their own fans. Uh, well, I guess our old fans. But um, yeah, I mean, that's basically it, really. Uh, predictions I'm going 1 1. You're going 2 2. Yeah. Um, should be an interesting one. Hopefully, we pick up the three points. I'm a little bit nervous, obviously, what happened last time. Yeah, last very time nervous. we were six points off the top. Third. And third. This year it's the exact same thing, so, so uh, fingers crossed yeah. doesn't happen again. So uh, yeah, we'll see you guys all in the ground, and uh, yeah, see you in the ground. Come on, boys! Right, guys, as you can see there, we've got Ayatin Gold, Gunter, Obita, McShane, Blackett, Vandenberg, Evans, Williams, Beeren, and McCleary, and Samuel. You see, we've got on the bench as well. We've got Stuart Moore, Cooper, Mendes, Harriet, Mate, Watson, and Kelly. Decent team shoot, really. Uh, obviously, Joey Vandenberg coming in and replacing. Um, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I'm happy with it. I mean, I did say in the uh, preview that I wouldn't mind Joey coming in and centre back. Um, Piers Hon's not starting for them, which is a good thing. Uh, Chris Martin, no up front. Uh, so it should be a pretty interesting game. Yeah, Hopefully, we can win the win. Come on, boys. Clappers. One for three. McShane at the back. Rackles in a tie. We're ready to see. We're on our way back. Do 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 do. Of course! As Stop. soon as I give him praise, he starts playing shit again! Shit! Why is he done? What was the point of doing? There was no one there as well. He could have prevented that, you know. He didn't have to do that. That's up there with Wolves at the moment. I mean, obviously you can't say, oh yeah, the game's over, stuff like that, but yeah. it's been shocking. Yeah, not very good. Um, Chris Gunner, though. <laughs> yeah, Chris Gunner got back into my good books and uh, straight back out. I think him, Joey, and Paul McShane have just been... Not Paul McShane, sorry. Him, Joey, and Obita have just all been shocking. Terrible. Yeah, no, it's terrible. Um, no one's played well, I think. No. No, I, I would literally take a point at this point. I said at the start as well, I'd take a point, but we've been shocking and we really need to sort out half time. I'd like to see May take come on that, that could be an improvement. Yeah, uh, hopefully go on beer and the buzz is really bad. Spent um, most time on the floor, but, but um, hopefully the second half. He's not doing anything right, but uh, yeah, hopefully we can do better in the second half. Come on, bro. Come on. How was that happening? How was that happen? We literally just, we literally are like this. Do you want to come through the defence? I know. Do you want to come through the defence? Come through the defence, please, please. We, we, we want to concede, please. It happened again, has it? It's happened again. Williams 
it's been sent off. I don't know what it's for, but he probably should have been sent off. Like, I don't have a clue what's gone on. It's all gone wrong. What? What? Oh, you scored, and then you can't go, oh no, you didn't, and then you can't go, oh, actually, no, you did score. You can't just go, oh, yeah, you scored, no, you haven't, yeah, you have, no, you haven't. Jeez. Another shit ref, you're just another shit ref. Ref, you're just another shit ref. You're just another shit ref. Four men. Four men. Four men. Down the tunnel, head down, not clapping the fans. Clap the fans. We got highlights and stats for today's match. The scores for all the girls on the big screens for you shortly. Come and clap the fans. Oh, Kelly. Five goals. Five goals that really embarrassed us by. Fulham, no, I'm not even going to blame it on bad refs or bad anything like that. Fulham were just fantastic and we were we were absolutely shocking, weren't we? Adam? Yeah, really bad. 5-0. Um, <sighs> God, where do we start? <laughs> where do we start? Where do we start? Let's start from the back. Uh, Ali Al Habsi, as much as you can say, oh yeah, keepers aren't to blame, keepers aren't to blame, all things like that. At the end of the day, for the fifth goal, yeah, it was 4-0 at that point, but for the fifth goal, Ali Al Habsi literally turned it in his net. Chris Martin's at the free kick and he literally just, oh, I don't even know yeah, what he was he doing. Trick, nah, I think he got two in the end because, uh, moving on to the next player I'm going to blame, at right back, Chris Gunter. Uh, <laughs> Chris Gunter. God, I don't know what he was doing for that own goal. I don't even know what he's doing, I can't even explain it. He literally could have just left it and it would have went out for a throw in, but no, instead, Chrissy Gunter, after the praise I've given him, has decided to uh, turn it into his own net. Then we've gone ahead and got to Tyler Blackett. What do you think of Blackett? God, um. He. Uh, I know, he slipped for the yeah. goal. He slipped he did it. for their Sweet. third goal, uh, which wasn't really the greatest, was it? Uh, going on to left back, Jordan Obita. I'm pretty sure we had a crisp packet pay there, didn't yeah. we? Because um, I'm pretty sure that would have done more than Obita. Um, centre mid, we had Joey Vandenberg, who I feel like we rushed him back into the game. Um, yeah, I totally agree. Uh, as in the game, I did say, well, just at the end, I did say, um, obviously, I don't think. Uh, he was a match fit to be honest, um, Joe Vanderbilt. But again, this was oh, Danny really Williams uh, got himself sent off. Which is, that's yeah. brilliant, isn't it? Well done, Danny. That was absolutely fantastic. Was great bit of thinking there from Williams, uh, getting himself sent off. I uh, don't know what it was for yet, obviously, we've only just come back. Um, George Evans, he was a bit useless as well. Probably was the better one uh, of the three man midfield. Uh, then we had Gareth McCleary, who was invisible. Uh, Roy Beerins, who 
Was Roy Burns on the starting eleven? Because uh, I don't remember seeing him yeah, play. Apparently he was. Um, God, it was terrible. He had nothing when he came off. Dominic Samuel oh, again. Cheers when he came off. Dominic Samuel tried. I'll give him that. He tried, but he didn't really try very hard. And then finally, <laughs> subs. God, they just yeah. did nothing either, did they? Terrible. Um, Shocking from everyone at the yeah, end of the day. Kelly tried. Kelly had a bit of passion. The one thing that annoyed me the most was uh, when uh, Joe Vandenberg walked. Joe Vandenberg. Joe Vandenberg walked down the tunnel without even clapping the fans goodbye, which is absolutely ridiculous. Yeah. Clap the fans that you've just embarrassed. Um, but yeah, that's basically going to be it for the video, guys. Um, absolute shambles. Absolutely perfect. I've been James. I've been Adam. And we'll see you guys in the next one.